Hi YouTube, welcome to another edition of Horror Hands and today is going to be a bit of a special video it's an exciting day today because I'm going to check out Martin's DVD shop so this is a, a shop in Sutton which is a town just next to me and he specialises in selling like uh, Blu-rays and DVDs uh, action figures, comics, books, things like that not just horror but I think there's a, a lot of horror there and uh, I've been in touch with Martin, he's a super nice guy. He said that I can come down and check the place out. He's gonna let me film as well. So I'm gonna take you guys with me and we'll check out Martin's shop and, and see what he's got. So so this is my first out and about video. Uh, so you might have to bear with me with some of the filming. Might get a bit of shaky cam going on. Um, but I'm really excited to go down and, uh, and check this place out and uh, see what he's got. So stay tuned and uh, we will uh, go and check out Martin's DVD shop and see what's what. All right guys, so we're just on the way to Martin's DVDs. About to get to Sutton, it's about 10, 15 minutes away. And uh, interestingly, I did go here a few years ago before that pandemic and all that, and it was, uh, it was really cool. We had some great stuff. So I'm looking forward to going back. It was nice to hear that it was still there and uh, hopefully it's still got some good stuff so uh, yeah about 10-15 minutes away uh, we'll get over there and, uh, and we'll have a look at what's what and what he's got all right guys so we're here at martin's dvds managed to find the shop looks like he's got a lot of cool stuff in the window so we'll have a closer look have a look at what's here in the front so it looks like we've got quite a few cool things some good figures Street Sharks, had a few of them as a kid. Got some Star Wars stuff down here. Over here we've got some comics and things. Thunderbirds, Green Hornet, Joe 90. Oh. And then a few things up here. So yeah, from first glances, it's looking good. So we'll uh, have a wander inside and we'll see what else he's got. All right guys, we're inside Martins and wow, this is, this is awesome, so much stuff. I gotta try and take it all in. But uh, come in and we've got a load of stuff here uh, on uh, on my left hand side. It looks like this is all kind of Western and war stuff. Some some really good films. A lot of stuff I've not seen for a while here. But yeah, immediately I'm impressed with the, uh, the war and Western genre that he's got here. Coming through, we've got loads of CDs, all kinds of stuff here, some records, old vinyls. More movies here. Place is just stacked with, with cool stuff. Range of figures here. Gosh, you could spend hours in this place, guys. Down here, got some good stuff here. A bunch of steel books and things along the top. But they live. I might have that before I go today. Got the nice uh, premium collection here from Warner Brothers. I know a lot of people collect these, so got all these available down here. Pretty awesome. <laughs> loads and loads of Blu-rays. Lots of different choice. More steel books again. Independence Day, steel book, Godzilla, 3D. Awesome. Lego, if anyone likes Lego. Gosh, more figures here. Pop, pop figures. I know a lot of you like this kind of stuff. Loads of them there. Down here, down here, I've got some cool retro video games. Gosh, Sega Mega Drive, Power Rangers, Pit Fighter. That's pretty awesome. Cool retro gaming section. And then over here, we've got a giant wall of TV, Blu-rays and uh, DVDs. Gosh, lots of stuff here. All different kind of TV shows. Everything from Jackass to Downton Abbey, by the looks of it. But yeah, that's pretty awesome. Got some cool things here. Down the counter. Some good horror selections here. So some old school Arrow, vid Arrow video releases with the window box sets. Look at that, that's nice. City of the Living Dead. Awesome artwork on that. Other things through here. Oh, gosh, 
retro. Is that VHS or is that Blu-ray? Blu -ray. This is Blu-ray. Yeah, limited edition. That's awesome. So this is a Blu-ray that looks like a, I guess like a VHS Betamax tape. Hmm. Red box edition. Red box edition. I have heard of that. Teaching me something. This is great. <laughs> Might have that later. Uh, what's that? I've not seen that before. <laughs> Uh, media book, but it comes in a wooden box. You can also get in a media type one. Okay. Look at that, guys. Media book. Yeah, wooden. Yeah, wooden. Yeah. Gosh. Wooden Blu ray, the Hellraiser movies. It's awesome. Never seen that before. Gosh, there's all sorts here, guys. Okay. Grizzly. One of my favourites. Awesome. Gosh, Boy Omega, awesome movie. Gosh, some amazing stuff here. I'm gonna have a look at that when I'm done, pick a few things up. Moving around here, gosh, some old retro toys in here. Mars Attacks, some Ghostbusters stuff. Star Wars, Robocop. Man, if you're into your old fashioned toys, there's a uh, it's a treasure trove. Around here looks like we've got some family films, things like that. Bit of everything again here. Yeah, good selection there. We've got some old wrestling DVDs down here. I don't know if there's any attitude error, but if there is, I'll be taking them with me. Awesome. More stuff around here, guys. Some more toys, figures, all boxed up. Gosh, trying to take everything in. Got some martial arts round here. Bruce Lee, Van Damme. Some more steel books there, look. It's that X Men 2. Gosh. All right, guys, moving on from that, we've got some books here. Loads of different stuff for you, mainly horror stuff. Ghosts and horror, look at that. Awesome. Star Wars archives, monsters in the movies, hardback of monsters in the movies, two copies of that. More Star Wars things. So much Star Wars stuff here, guys, if you're into Star Wars. More sort of uh, miscellaneous stuff here. Lots of great movies here. JFK. Crikey, yeah, all kinds of stuff. I think there's stuff behind this as well, so there's even more stuff as well, guys, to be uh, to be looking at. More retro figures here. Lord of the Rings stuff. <laughs> Men in Black Aliens. Down here, guys. <laughs> That's awesome. Star Wars stuff again. What we got here? Oh, and then this one, we've got a bit more of a horror DVD section here. Gosh, we're getting Ghostbusters things, they're cool. Man. But yeah, um, horror DVDs here, Dawn of the Dead, Wolfman, what's that? Ghost House 6. Look at that. That's nice. One of these, uh, what do you call them? Yeah, one of these kind of things. That's awesome. Phantasm box set here. Gosh, spooky stories. More toys here, guys. And then more horror DVDs here. Gosh, lots of good stuff. All the way down. Double stacked by the look of it. What we got here? Just till dawn. Honestly, guys, there's everything. Lots of different stuff. All great condition as well, man. I need to have a bit of, uh, bit of time looking through these. Just... <laughs> Just films on top of films. Music DVDs. If you're into your music. Gosh. Oh, and comics down here as well, guys. If you're into your comic books, I'm not personally, but you guys can tell me if there's any good ones here. Spawn. More comics here. And then what we've got here. More music. Musicals. So, uh... Gosh, yeah, I'm really impressed. This is uh, this is an awesome place. So if you are, if you're in Nottingham, if you're in Sutton, 
any neighbouring areas, definitely check out Martin's DVD shop. It's awesome. So I'm going to have a bit of a dive into what he's got and uh, I'll come back and let you know if I've picked anything up. All right, guys, that was awesome. Really enjoyed looking around there. Got a bag of goodies, which I'll, uh, I'll get back home and I'll show you in more detail. But uh, yeah, like I say, if you're ever in the Sutton area, Martin's DVDs is where it's at. Fantastic. Nice guy as well. So I'll see you back home. I'll let you know what I've got. Hi, guys. So we're back from uh, Martin's DVD shop. It's been an amazing day. I <laughs> really, really enjoyed it. Thank you so much, Martin, for, for having us and being so accommodating. Really enjoyed looking around your shop. So I've got some, uh, got a few cool things which I thought I'd just uh, just show you that I picked up today. So the first thing I got, uh, this is really cool. This is Ghost House 6. And this is one of these, uh, I can't remember what these are called. Not, not Digibook, but uh, one of these kind of thick pack releases. Someone in the comments will tell me. Uh, yeah, Ghost House 6. I think from looking at the artwork and the pictures on the back, this is, uh, is it Beyond Darkness? Yeah, I have this as Beyond Darkness, but uh, really, really nice release. Great pictures on there. And I've not, uh, I don't own one of these kind of things either. So it just comes with the uh, the disc like that. But uh, yeah, this is really cool. Really cool to have. So yeah, Ghost House 6. Awesome stuff. Next thing, this is pretty awesome. This one, when I saw it, I was a bit of a noob and thought it was a VHS or a Betamax, but it's it's not. It looks like an old VHS. This is Demons uh, in this uh, sort of red VHS case. Uh, but this is actually a Blu-ray, a Blu-ray release. So um, that's the artwork on the back. And then inside... Yeah, a little demons card like that. And it looks like you get a bit of a, a booklet on some of the other films that they release. Yeah, a few other things in there. Yeah, you can get the idea. And then uh, and then yeah, you get the Blu-ray disc of demons inside. So really nice, really nice presentation. Don't really have much much like this, many releases like this in the collection. So I just thought that was an interesting one uh, to grab while I was there. So yeah, pretty cool stuff. So that's an interesting release of Demons there. And just got a few kind of, a uh, few other movies. Picked up The Honeymoon Killers from Arrow. Not seen this before. It's a, a film that I wanted to check out. So I grabbed the, uh, the Arrow Blu-ray while I was there. I also got The Chilling. Again, this is a film that I've wanted to see for quite a while. So this was just uh, in there on the shelf. So I, I picked this one up. This is a Shriek Show release as well. So that's pretty cool. So I'll grab that one. I grabbed this... Uh, what's this called? Malatesta's Carnival of Blood. I've no idea what this is, never seen this before. It just looked very obscure and very weird. <laughs> so I thought I'll, I'll grab that while I'm in there. And then the last thing I bought is Zombie Ass Toilet of the Dead. Because how could you pass up a title like that? This one looks absolutely insane. So yeah, didn't want to leave it on the shelf. So we got that as well. And then Martin was uh, also pretty awesome. He, he gifted me a couple of things, uh, a few sort of like promotional books from, from back in the day that seemed to be promoting horror films of the time. So this first one, Fantasy Film Memory. And this one is all about Lucio Fulci and his movies. Uh, so got some really cool... I'm not going to show it how I want to. Really cool imagery in this and, and information about about his uh, his movies. Uh, I don't really know much about where these are from or when they're from, but they look pretty old and pretty pretty retro. Some good stuff there. Uh, so that's that one. 
Uh, there's one on Dario Argento. And again, just loads of information on his films. Loads of great images and, uh, and information on, uh, on his movies. And then uh, this one, this is pretty awesome. This is for Cannibal Holocaust. Never seen this before. Probably can't show a lot of these images, to be honest. Yeah, it's pretty graphic, this one is. Um, but again, looks like some pretty in-depth information on the film and the director, there's Ruggero there on set. So, uh, yeah, awesome stuff. Thank you so much for them, Martin. So, yeah, great day. That's the things that I got. Let me know what you what you think of them uh, but like i say if you're in if you're in the area or if you uh if you're interested in anything that you saw get in touch with martin he's happy for me to put his details in the video below and uh and and, and i'm sure uh, i'm sure he'll help you out with anything if he can so uh thank you very much for watching that guys and stay tuned for more videos